In this Academy short, we'll discuss the Knowledge Management V3 homepage and the Knowledge Management Service Portal. In the Washington DC release, we're redirecting new customers from the Knowledge Management V3 homepage to the Knowledge Management Service Portal. Upgrade customers can take advantage of this feature as well, simply by setting a system property. The Knowledge V3 homepage is accessed in Next Experience by navigating to the All menu, Self-Service, Knowledge. The Knowledge V3 homepage displays knowledge bases that you have access to. You can also see Featured, Most Useful, and Most Viewed content. You can search for articles within a knowledge base or across knowledge bases using Zing Search. You can filter search results by two criteria, knowledge base and category in the Knowledge Management V3 homepage. This limitation is one of the reasons we're redirecting to the Knowledge Management Service Portal as of the Washington DC release. You can sort results by relevancy, last updated, and views. Within a knowledge base, you can filter articles by categories or tags. When clicking into the article, you'll see the classic environment version. You can leave feedback and perform other actions as determined by your system administrator. As mentioned, the Knowledge Management Service Portal is redirected to by default for new Washington DC customers. Upgrade customers can enable a system property to perform the redirect. This property is also available in releases prior to Washington DC. So if you want to get a jump start on this now in a sub-production environment, there are no limitations. There are multiple properties related to the Knowledge Management Service Portal. Check the product documentation to learn more. Set the Glide, Nomen, Service Portal, Enable Underscore Redirect Property to True. Now when you navigate in Next Experience to All, Self-Service, Knowledge, you'll be redirected to the Knowledge Management Service Portal. It's important to note this change only affects Next Experience and Core UI users, and does not impact users using Employee Center, Service Portal, or other portals. The Knowledge Management Service Portal homepage will display knowledge bases that you have access to, as well as featured, most useful, and most viewed content. If you have editing permissions, you can create articles from here as well. Just like the V3 homepage, you can perform searches via Zing Search. You can filter by language if you have translated articles available. Knowledge bases that you have access to. Categories. Author. Rating. Last modified source and view count clicking into a knowledge article will display the article view page where you can subscribe to articles and view other most useful articles as well you can flag articles to create feedback tasks and edit the article if you are an author or in the ownership group you can also leave feedback such as marking an article as helpful, rating, and posting a comment with advanced commenting. Advanced commenting is not available on the Knowledge V3 homepage. To learn more about configuring the Knowledge Management Service Portal, head over to our product documentation site. Here you'll also find a comparison of both the Knowledge Management V3 homepage and the Knowledge Management Service Portal so you can understand more about the capabilities found in each for when you transition. The Knowledge Management Service Portal offers administrators much more configuration options than the Knowledge V3 homepage. We recommend using the free on-demand Knowledge Management Implementation Training on Now Learning. Here you'll find a section called Portals and Employee Center. You'll see sections on how to configure the homepage, the search results page, and the article view page. 
Alongside the Now Learning Training, we also have a built-in guided setup to assist you with configuring the Knowledge Management Service Portal as well as other knowledge management features. Navigate to All, Knowledge, Guided Setup. Within the Guided Setup, you'll find helpful advice for your knowledge management implementation. You can track your progress along the way as you implement different features for knowledge management. There is a section dedicated to configuring the Knowledge Management Service Portal with tasks you can assign to other administrators. This section will walk you through configuring the Home page, Search Results page, Article View page, and how to perform the redirection if you're an upgrade customer. If you want to know more about this topic and other knowledge management topics, sign up for our monthly Live Knowledge Management Academy session every second Tuesday of the month at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can sign up for the Knowledge Management Academy, other platform academies, and more ServiceNow events by going to the community. In this video, you learned about the Knowledge V3 homepage and the features of the Knowledge Management Service Portal. You also learned about the changes coming for new and upgrade customers in Washington, and where to find more information. Thanks for watching.